I am so excited. Yeah? I've been waiting all summer for Coach Prime. Let's go. Oh, the excitement on campus here on Pearl Street, it is palpable. Karen, can you believe that it was all the way back in December when Deion Sanders accepted the head coaching position at CU? He came to Boulder and almost immediately started going on a tour of the city and didn't waste any time chowing down either. No, he had his priorities right, right? <laughs> yeah, right. <laughs> Find the best restaurants, the best food, and get in there. All right, it took him a few restaurants, of course, but he finally found his favorite grits at Lucille's. Well, Michael and I had the chance to taste them for ourselves. Okay, I don't know, but our job is like the best, right? We get to spend the day in Boulder. We're getting ready for our big Boulder Buffs Nebraska game, and we thought we would come to Boulder and kind of like maybe try to learn a little bit more, maybe hit the spots that Coach Prime hit whenever he first got here. Coach Prime moves to Boulder. He goes out to eat. He highlights a bunch of places, and one of the places that he highlights was Lucille's because they have one of his favorite foods, grits. Yeah, one of our favorite foods, too. Who doesn't now. love grits? <laughs> we can't wait to check it out. So we're going to go inside here. We're going to meet Fletcher, who owns mm -hmm. Lucille's. They've been here forever. We're going to taste some of these grits and just give you a little sneak peek of what's inside. So I come on. I can smell them right now. Let's go. Hi. Hi. Karen, so nice, nice to, to see you. you. How are you? Oh, we are so excited to learn a little bit more about Lucille. Chef Michael. Hey, how are you? Well, the right way to make grits is by putting lots of love and lots of time in them. So we're just going to pour them inside with all of Lucille's trademark ingredients. So Fletcher, tell us about the inspiration for Lucille's and where that came from. It came from desperation, <laughs> actually. Yeah, I said, I tell you what, we're going to change the whole menu and we're going to cook Creole breakfast. What do you think about that? He said, it's never going to work. <laughs> <laughs> what has the reaction been like from around the community when people come in and say, hey, this is the spot where Coach Prime went? People are so excited, obviously. It's a, it's a game changer for our town and he's an amazing person. So it's, it's wonderful, and uh, customers love it. And it's a, such a small place. And of course, football players don't fit in here very well, <laughs> right? Because they're generally kind of big. Do I smell something coming this yeah, way? Yeah, oh I see God. something coming this way. Oh there my gosh, go. look at this. These are different varieties of grits. OK, so what do we have here? This is our shrimp and grits. And our shrimp and grits, we serve it any of the three ways that we serve grits here, which is cheese grits, jalapeno cheese grits, or just plain grits. Our shrimp and grits is made with um, our homemade Creole seasoning, some roasted red peppers, our andouille sausage. And all of that stuff is stir fried together a little bit with some olive oil. We put our shrimp in there. Gets that nice juices flowing between the pork and the shrimp. But those two marry very well. And we put that on top of our grits. So this is what you think Coach Prime came in and got, right? I believe so. The go-to dish. That is excellent. Yeah, I can see why Coach Prime gave it an A. Pancho, this has been great. Thank you so much for having us. I'm going to get another spoonful of these grits before we take off. Yeah, we have to eat the shrimp, too. And Michael, do you mind passing me those mm. croutons there? Oh, my gosh, grit croutons. Fantastic. I'm going to eat some of these. Don't mind me going in for another spoonful. Those were absolutely delicious. Shout out to Fletcher, his entire staff. They were so great to come in. And Dion was funny when he did his segment there. He said, I'm going to give it an A minus because the portions are too big. And Fletcher's wife, who uh, runs the restaurant with him, said, well, that's our motto. You come for breakfast and you leave with dinner. <laughs> it was so good, wasn't it? Yeah. I was just laughing. I was going back and I, my mouth started watering as <laughs> we're watching that. It's terrible. All right, time now to check in with First Alert Meteorologist Lauren. The weather is just fantastic out here. It is.